Howdy folks, it's General Heat here. How's everyone doing today? So, for today's video, we're going to be tackling a pretty interesting question that was actually brought up to me uh, very recently. And that is the question of, are there actually rats on the map Rat's Nest in Halo 3? So, the map Rat's Nest, it's a, it was a, originally a DLC map for Halo 3, and as the name would imply, you would think there would be a lot of rats on this map, because it's supposed to be a nest of rats. But a lot of people have pointed out and have noticed that there actually don't seem to be any rats at all on this map. At least not any living rats. You see, uh, on certain parts of the map, you kind of have to look around. It's, uh, it can be hard to spot sometimes. But on the floor, in some certain areas, like usually like around the active camo area, you can sometimes find dead rats on the ground. But these dead rats aren't um they're not actually real rats in the game they're uh you know they're not actually bodies they can shoot they're like they're part of the ground texture or model essentially and you know if you shoot it well no nothing really happens it's not actually a real rat dead body but it is there technically but it seems like there's you know there's no not actually any living uh, rats on the map like any actual rat bodies like real ones and it, it's not uncommon for multiplayer maps in Halo 3 to have like actual living creatures on it. Like the map Valhalla, there's a lot of fish swimming out in the water actually, um, out here like by this lake here. And you know, these are actually real fish in the game. You can uh, interact with them, you can shoot them, you can kill them as well. And you know, their their bodies will actually flow in the water and just drift away. There's also butterflies on this map. If you throw a grenade, it doesn't kill the butterflies, it pushes them away. And then they actually fly back to that spot. So like all these creatures, they, they have like some limited like AI to just like swim around or fly around a certain area. So how do these creatures work? Well, in the game files, they're not bipeds or like AIs or anything like that. They're actually just what, literally just called creatures in the game files. And right here you can see this is for the map Valhalla. Valhalla actually has three types of butterflies and it has a special kind of fish. And you know, these are all the creatures available on the map Valhalla. Whereas on a map Rat's Nest, there actually is literally no actual rats on a map Rat's Nest. There's no like rat creature or anything. The only creatures on this map are the LOD Hornets and Pelicans. Uh, LOD meaning basically it's like a low texture, low detail version of the Hornet and Pelicans. For the ambient life on this map. Which, yeah, I know it kind of sounds like silly because they're not actually ambient life. They're just, they're actually these like Pelicans and Hornets flying around in the distance. But... As you can see, they're not actually like real vehicles flying around there. That's actually, as far as the game is concerned, like under the hood and everything, what you see flying out there, it's actually the ambient life of this map. Those pelicans and hornets, they're technically living creatures just flying around out there like birds, only except they're pelicans and hornets and also just low detail, low texture and everything. But. That's basically all the only living creatures available on this map, just pelicans and hornets. There are no actual living rats on this map, and uh, I have no idea why there's no actual rats on this map. But it's a uh, you know it's a little odd odd thing that they left out, and could be intentional, could be they forgot to add um, you know living rats on this map. But who knows? But anyways, yeah, it's just a little fun question I wanted to tackle because uh, it's you know a bit of an interesting week. But anyways. Bit of a shorter video but hopefully you guys did enjoy it nonetheless and found it to be uh interesting but if you did uh make sure to leave a like uh, leave your thoughts in the comments if there's um anything else for me to check out look into uh, any questions you have any experiments you want to tackle or stuff like that just let me know in the comments below but other than that make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you all next time bye guys